2022 Jeep Grand Cherokee First Drive, Building a Better Billy Goat But before we start, please support us by pressing the like and subscribe buttons, so that we can continue to provide information about car and motorcycle news. Also turn on the bell button to get the latest updates. Your support means a lot to us. Thank you. Jeep threw us a curveball when it introduced the all-new WO Grand Cherokee, the fifth-generation model of the long-running SUV, with the stretched 2021 liters model. The latter is the first-ever three-row Grand Cherokee. It was a palm slap to the forehead moment for a brand celebrating its 80th birthday. Jeep has sold 7 million Grand Cherokees globally since 1992, and every one has been a five-passenger, two-row SUV. But 75% of the large SUVs the Grand Cherokee competes with are equipped with or offer a third row, so the Jeep was playing in a game where it wasn't even swinging the bat in most innings. So yeah, we get why Jeep added the three-row L and launched it first. Now, one model year later, we have the WL with a conventional layout that made the Grand Cherokee a household name and bestseller. Deliveries of the 2022 Jeep Grand Cherokee have begun in North America, and all dealerships should have some in stock by the end of the year. The Grand Cherokee 4Z plug-in hybrid follows early in 2022. New Grand Cherokees, both two and three row, are being built at the new Mack plant in the Detroit assembly complex. The Jefferson plant, which made the outgoing model, is being retooled and will be able to make the new two row in 2022 while continuing to also make the current Dodge Durango. It certainly looks like Jeep expects to sell more Grand Cherokees with its expansion to a family of three versions. Putting the 2022 Grand Cherokee through its paces. Is the 2022 Grand Cherokee a leap forward? We spent a few days in Moab, Utah, for a little seat time in the WL, both on and off-road. The regular Grand Cherokee is offered in five trim levels plus two packages. The look has been updated inside and out with an impressive use of high-end materials and attention to detail. The 2022 model is immediately recognizable for what it is, there are no big styling departures from the traditional look, and the powertrains, 4 WD systems and available air suspension carry over. But make no mistake, this is an all-new Grand Cherokee where every aspect was touched and enhanced in some way, right down to the metal gear shifter, now flanked by the controls for ride height and terrain select to emphasize the vehicle's jeepness. New Architecture Tricky For starters, the latest Grand Cherokees ride on a new architecture, the old one dated back a decade. Early reports had the SUV sharing underpinnings with the Alfa Romeo Giulia, which held the potential for some sublime on-road manners. The brands within Stellantis, formerly Fiat Chrysler Automobiles, are encouraged to use existing architectures where possible, so the idea was explored, vehicle line executive Tom Seal said. But in the end, Stellantis engineers felt Jeep and Alpha catered to customers at opposite ends of the spectrum, Jeep needs a level of off-road prowess that Alpha does not require, and Alpha needs an on-road dynamism that exceeds what Jeep needs to offer. To share a platform would require more compromise than either team of engineers was comfortable with. So Jeep got its own architecture, and Alpha engineers contributed to the tuning for on-road dynamics. Most competitors would do two different cars to cover the span that the Grand Cherokee covers, Seal said of the need to straddle two very distinct forms of driving and do both well. It makes it unique. Seal was told the architecture needed a 10-year horizon, which meant it must prepare for an electric and autonomous future starting with the 2022 Jeep Grand Cherokee 4Z plug-in hybrid coming early next year, and eventually a pure EV. The 4Z hybrid will have an estimated range of 25 miles of all-electric range and a combined range of more than 440 miles. Jeep is slated to get its first pure battery electric model in 2023, likely a Wrangler, but eventually all models will have an electric variant. The 2022 Grand Cherokee carries over its combustion engines. The base engine is the 293 horsepower, 260 pound to foot 3.6 liter V6. The 357 horsepower, 390 pound to foot 5.7 liter Hemi V8 is an option for the top three trim levels and comes with four wheel drive standard. Both engines are mated to an eight speed automatic transmission. We were happy with their performance in the longer, heavier L. Not surprisingly, they performed even better in the smaller SUV, which is about 250 pounds lighter and one mile per gallon more fuel efficient. Tinkering with looks. The 5th Gen Grand Cherokee is lower and has a longer hood and tapered roof for better aerodynamics while maintaining interior space. Jeep is backtracking from the industry trend to high belt lines, so the GC's line was lowered 0.4 inch, which translates to more glass for increased light. 
Improved visibility is a hallmark of new Jeeps, including the new 2022 Jeep Wagoneer and 2022 Jeep Grand Wagoneer. Lowering the belt line meant lowering the powertrain. Thanks for watching. Drop a like. Leave a comment. And don't forget to subscribe to watch more videos like this.